What is up guys, it's Technology Guy with Fortnite today an unboxing for you guys. We got the iPhone 6S Plus unboxing right there. Very nice beautiful phone. Here's a box comparison to the iPhone 6S. It's a bigger phone, a nice lot more better phone. Um, so they are the sizes of the picture, so it's pretty cool there. Wow, so that's a very nice size of a phone. So I did unbox the iPhone 6S. It is on my channel, so if you guys want to go check that out, um, it will be a link in the description to that 6S Space Gray 16 gig unboxing. If you're interested in the smaller phone, then go check out that iPhone 6S unboxing. So here's the actual front of the box. Uh, you have iPhone 6S Plus on the side. Over here, you just have a Space Gray Apple logo. On the other side of the box, it says iPhone 6S Plus as well. And another Apple logo. Very nice. So this is the 64 gigabyte version of the phone. I decided a 16 gig is not enough, especially with 4K video now that is included on this phone. Um, you have a lot more better features. You have 3D touch on the actual phone. Uh, you have a new and improved 12 megapixel camera and all those nice features that you would get on the iPhone 6. We will go in detail once we actually unbox this bad boy. Alright, taking off the plastic, we are heading to the front of the device and opening this bad boy up. Here we have it, the iPhone 6S Plus very very beautiful phone right there very nice color I am in love with that space gray alright so on the front of the box we do have the actual iPhone 6 plus very nice you see 6 iPhone S there's the actual phone so let's set this to the side next to its little brother the iPhone 6s right there look at that size difference very nice so let's get this stuff out of the way. Let's get inside the box. Here we have all the nice accessories. Um, on the bottom of this tray, you do have the Designed by Apple in California packaging. Uh, pretty much with all your info. Inside of there, you do have the iPhone 6 Plus um, kind of welcome guide. It's not a book anymore. Um, it looks like Apple's gone away from books. It's just a nice little kind of postcard, uh, hard paper. Um, showing you the buttons on the actual iPhone, what they do. Um, not even what they do, it just tells you what they are. I'm pretty sure you would know once they are. And on the back it just says, Welcome to start. Turn your iPhone, pressing the hold and sleep wait button for a few seconds, and allow the on screen instructions to set up your iPhone. Learn more. Uh, get support. So it looks like their actual manuals and all that is online, which is kind of good and at the same time I mean it's good for them saving paper but I kind of like my manuals even though I never look at them but it's kind of nice to have uh, phone info so a warranty and all that in there and the famous Apple stickers are also included um, really wish they mat color matched the Apple stickers shows like the new MacBook uh, but they are unfortunately just white stickers which is fine with me but uh, I would very be happy if we got uh, space gray stickers and by the looks of it, you don't get a SIM eject tool, uh, which kind of sucks, but I do have a couple of them, so that's fine with me, but uh, that does kind of suck. Alright, back to the box. You do have the simple accessories you get in the box. You do get your lightning cable to USB, right there, the regular lightning cable. You do get the charging brick uh, that you get in all the iPhones. And you get your ear pods. Very nice very nice ear pods very cool all right so setting this aside you do have the iphone 6s and the iphone 6s right next to each other and there you have it very beautiful devices if you set them on top of each other you see the different size between the 6s and the 6s plus very nice so here's my space gray family we have the iPhone 6s 6s plus the space gray iPad and my space gray beats which is a very nice addition 
um, it's kind of close to the color I would no it, it matches it's a nice space gray edition very nice space gray iPad there iPad Air so that's my space gray family all right back to the actual importance of the iPhone 6 plus you do have the new touch ID sensor on the front this is the second generation so it's a lot more accurate than the first generation touch ID uh, ever since I've been using the iPhone 6 s I would agree um, I've never had an iPhone 6 uh, but I'm very impressed with the iPhone 6 s on its fingerprint sensor um, just it's an amazing uh, it automatically unlocks so it's very cool um, on the bottom you do have a couple of ports right there you have the let it focus there the headphone jack the lightning connector microphone next to the headphone jack and the speaker right on the side of the speaker go on the back you had an Apple logo you got the antenna lines uh, right on top and bottom um, you have the new 12 megapixel camera uh, as well it does 4k now uh, you have the LED flash next to it another microphone right in the center um, this one has the optical stabilization uh, stabilizes um, the actual camera on this one versus the iPhone 6 has doesn't have the optical stabilization um, another good feature to get the 6s plus uh, you do have a better battery life than the 6s very nice addition as well uh, it does have a bigger battery uh, for the case that it has a bigger screen on this side you have the volume up and down rockers and the mute or orientation lock button there other side of the device you do have the sim eject uh, tray and the power button nothing else nothing on the top very nice device there let's power it up and there you have the Apple logo alright so since it's the exact same home menu I'm going to use my 6s to show you all the features uh, for the reason that I'm gonna to have to set up and um, I'm gonna to have to back up that one for my 6s to get all my stuff on there but let's use the 6s as you can see how fast that fingerprint sensor is on here look at that very nice um, so on the front this is your home screen um, so the force touch how it works is pretty much how much pressure you actually put on the screen so if you tap let's say the camera it's just gonna open if you put more pressure on the camera it's gonna give you a couple of different options it's gonna give you to take a selfie record a video record slow-mo and take a photo um, you could press on any of these that you want or you could you know, force touch and then just scroll down whichever way you want to do it either way works uh, it only works on some apps right now um, see not all of them it just bounces back if it doesn't work um, see not all of them mostly right now as of right now it's just the actual um, Apple apps that come pre-installed are the ones that are working not even all of them um, see Apple store app store works phone works mail works it's pretty cool it's a pretty cool device uh, you get your second page another cool thing about the new kind of 3d photo that they introduced in this XS is the 3d photo lock screen where you could take a photo for a couple of seconds and it's gonna pretty much you see that I barely tap it and it recognizes my fingerprint so I'm gonna have to unlock it on the side um, but you can set it up as your lock screen so if you force touch the home screen you see that it moves it's very nice very nice addition to this um, very 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 excited about this very nice it's gonna look great with my uh, black stainless steel Apple watch very nice I, I'm just in love with this Apple watch it's not even funny it's amazing it's the stainless steel so it's a very nice very nice uh, watch 
um, with the black sport band 42 millimeter uh, go check out the unboxing for this Apple watch which is a very nice addition um, of stainless steel all right guys so this was pretty much the unboxing of the iPhone 6s plus this technology guy will force signing out peace make sure to rate comment subscribe and thanks for watching guys